Hello. Um, my name is Nina Staple, as you probably know. I'm sorry. Um, I just wanted to talk to you today about are you trapped by the words of other people? Um, so often people can say things that probably aren't even meant the way that we take them. And it's up to us to decide whether we are going to allow those words to define who we are or what it is that we want out of life. Um, people can be upset about things and they can dump their garbage on us. And we'll take it on as being for real. But that really isn't real because other people's garbage is not ours. And it's so easy to take on issues that other people are having. And that's the thing that I want to talk about is do not allow other people's garbage to make us somebody that we're not. This is where character is built. This is where when we learn how to get through those challenges. And something that I have learned is it's usually a sign of insecurity. But don't allow that to bring you down. Always remember, it's not your issue, it's their issue. And don't take on what their issues are. This is something that, I've, you know, I've gone through several different things and I've been rolled right in the garbage that was there. And I'm just asking you to not do that because it makes you feel mad or bad. It makes you feel hurt when really it's not you that has the issue and and to say it sounds so easy to not take it on but it's something that we have to work at continually it took me I would bet a good year of reminding myself every time that somebody I felt was um, I don't, I don't know, stiffing you or thinking that you took on thinking that you weren't good enough for what they were thinking. Um, but that's not where we go. We have to keep the lid on their garbage. Don't take on their stuff. Become the bigger person. Okay? And that's how our character will be developed, becoming a better person. Because it's easy to spite back when somebody is saying something to us that's not nice. But if we just keep cool and immediately think, this is their issue. Why am I taking it on? Um, we know that if you can do that right away when it happens, instead of waiting until, you know, we build a case out of something that really isn't our, our stuff to build a case on. It's their stuff, and they have to work through that. If we can learn how to do that, you will build character so much faster. And that's what builds you to be a strong person. Um, I, I say that... I'm, I'm really on this thing. I just came back from this women's weekend and it's so, it was so awesome, but it's so easy for us. And, and, and it's just as easy for a man to become a victim as it is a woman when life is happening and stuff happens, but don't go there. Okay. The other thing that I want to say is we know that it builds character for us, but do not let other people steal your goals and your dreams. Because that's what happens when this garbage gets dumped on you is that, um, and, and you leave that lid off and so you take on the garbage instead of it being somebody else's issue, we take it on and then what happens to our goals and our dreams, they start disappearing. And don't ever let somebody else take your dreams from you. Those dreams and those desires were put inside of you, not by us. I believe that our dreams come from, um, from God that our goals, that he plants them deep inside of us. And that's why we have such a desire to accomplish them. So don't let anybody else take that away from you. Um, and I hope that, that with what I've shared here, it's something that I've gone through a lot. Just always remember, do the right thing. Do not take on what is their thing. Do the right thing and just stay the course of where you're going Keep your, keep your focus. Don't let other people trip up you, trip you up with your goals and your dreams. And let it always be their issue. It's not yours.
So thanks for watching. I hope that you were able to take something away from here. Have an amazing night. Hey, Deb, how are you doing? I don't know how on here to see if people make comments or not. But in Hi Barb, I can see that you're on. I see there's some more people, but I don't see the names. Um, so have an awesome night. Bye-bye. I've been challenged that I have to do three of these a week. So I see your comment now. Thanks, Deb. <laughs> I'm learning. But have an awesome night, you guys. And I thought I could watch this on a different thing, but I don't know how to do that yet. I'm, I'll figure it all out. Finish up here.